One Day at a Time is completely revamped. But it's a show that people loved back in the day. They expect a certain thing. Was there kind of like a trepidation, like, oh man, if I, if I don't get this right, I'm, I'm not gonna get it right, like? Not because of that. The yeah. trepidation was only uh, to make a great show with this amazing Latino cast, mm. or Latinx, Latinx. I gotta get into the thing, yeah. I love that. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. It, that, that was a pressure, not to, you know, not to be a stereotype. You know, so many times we're the butt of the joke, you know, so many times, you know, when when we were in situation comedies, when we are in situation comedies. So that the pressure was on for that to do to make a show that represents us. Right. That's what the pressure was. But I never thought about the the other show because it's completely different. Yeah. So I never thought about that. And if the if the audience of that show uh, maybe couldn't relate to our show, I uh, I'm OK with that because you know, it's, we have the audience that we have. And uh, I think they came along. I mean, I think at first, of course, they're like, what? This is not one day at a time. And you know, Pat Harrington, people love that character, Schneider. And even though Todd Grinnell does an amazing job, but he's a hitster Schneider now, you know. Did you and at least try the Bonnie Franklin haircut? I mean, <laughs> well, we actually, please tell me you, you know what, I it. have it. We did this whole promo where I was being Bonnie Franklin, but oh wow, that was not good. I look like, I, like there, <laughs> this is terrible. There's like a color hair that Latinas always get, like if mm -hmm. they go cheap and it's like the red hair. <laughs> Because our hair always pulls red. So you see, like, I call it the achote hair. So, I mean, so I had Bonnie Franklin, yeah, for a promo. I had that for a promo. There is pressure if you're representing an underrepresented group yeah. that networks and all the people the who pressure. make the decisions yeah. are going to decide if they can do it again or, you know. Yeah. It, we were at Netflix, which was different because yeah. if you know, listen, I love network television. I, I, I do. But I don't know how long it would have lasted. Yeah, I don't know if they would have been brave enough. Now I think they will. I mean, this is our third season. We're going into the third one. Uh, but I don't know if we would have been able to have all those storylines my daughter coming out, you know, all of these things, the, the political discussions, the immigration. Uh, I don't know if that would have been possible. So because we were on Netflix, I felt very relaxed because I knew we had 13 in the can. I knew that I couldn't come to work one day and they said, okay, we're canceled, <laughs> which has happened. Right. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I know everybody, right? that's, like, the, I'm like, oh, that, God. that's the worst, you know, the walking worst. into you the makeup keep, trailer. Keep and it's going. Just you have to keep going. Uh, we have to keep with the day, I know. Uh, so. Uh, like everything's normal. And you just gotta keep oh. on. But that, that was the pressure, just to be able to really tell real stories.